welcome back to another episode of Steph's Design Space. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, thank you. Today's episode, we are working in my faith planner um, because I'm breaking this up for the month of May. I am trying something different and that is um, plan, uh, doing five videos a week. So I will be doing a video for every section of this planner. So this is my faith planner, then I have the recovery planner, and then I have my physical wellness planner. So let's get started um, with this one. How is everyone? Okay, I'm trying to make this pretty, but these things kind of get in my way. But I like it pretty. Um, and no fire, because I almost caught some stuff on fire one time, <laughs> and it really worried some people, so I try not to do that anymore. All right, <clears throat> I pulled out all this washi because I'm not sure what I'm going to use with these. Okay, y'all, I could not help myself. These are so stinking adorable. Uh, I just love them so much. So I had to um, use these. But now I'm realizing I need something here. And these are my clear. So that isn't going to work right there. Okay, I'm going to just do that at the end. I'll figure it out. Okay, so what I use this for is my prayers. I was using it for my scripture writing. I'm taking a break from monthly scripture, I mean daily scripture writing because I'm doing a daily Bible study that has that in it. Um, and you know what? I should get that and show y'all what that is. Okay, I am back. This is the Bible study that I'm doing. Um, I ordered quite a few of these from the Daily Grace Company. I mean, find them on their website. This is not paid or anything. Um, but this is, it is well, walking away from anxiety and into God's word. I'm not writing in the book. Um, I got a helpful tip from somebody and it's, if you don't write in the book, then you can always give it to someone else who may need it. I was like, oh, that's such a good idea. So what I'm doing is, um, and here I'm just using regular note paper and doing week one, day one. So this is the one I've done. Um, there's just not enough space on the horizontal for this. So I'm just doing it on here. I'm not really decorating it or anything. This is just my Bible study. So that's how I'm using this um, planner in here. And then I'm using the horizontal for my prayers. Because this monthly... I'm just going to do that, but this is where I'm going to write who I'm praying for or who needs prayer. So when I'm talking to my friends or family or whomever, um, I can write their information. Then it also reminds me, hey, I heard this on this day. It's down here. Let me check on them, see how everything's doing. So that's what I'm using this for. Um, the horizontal is to write my prayers out. And then the um, notebook part is to uh, <clears throat> do my actual Bible study. So let's make this beautiful for my prayers. Okay, I, while I was up getting the book, I did get my quotes book because I feel like I have some faith quotes that can go here. I do. I have those. I have these, so I can definitely do that. And I also grabbed um, just some blank white sticker paper that I had. Um, because I have done some lineup changes. So if you want to see what those are, you're going to have to stay tuned and make sure you watch all the videos. Uh, Oh, look at this, Mel. I brought my straight edge over. Now I can do a straight line. <laughs> oh, goodness. 
I was trying to cut actually one of her stickers in one of my videos and messed it up because I didn't have a straight edge. And she's like, where's your ruler? And so the other day, I actually put some rulers over here that I would have it so I can actually cut somewhat straight. Anyway, okay guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and start on this. But in the meantime, if y'all could do me a huge favor, if you have not already, please hit the like, subscribe, and bell so you don't miss anything. Um, Cause like I said, I'm gonna be cranking out five a week for the month of May. I may continue, um, it depends. So depends on how much y'all like it or love it. But I have made a lineup change. I've added another planner back in and I've, I've switched two planners around. Let me just put it that way. All right, and let me, Okay, um, which one of these do I want to use? This is my old clear sticker paper. Y'all can see it's all shiny. And this is matte. So, love the difference. Um, I pray, not wish. I have God, not a genie. I like that one. So, I'm just going to put that right there. And then I will probably put a gnome or some... I almost said butterflies. Those are not butterflies. Ladybugs around it. All right. So put that to the side. And I may actually get some more quotes out. It depends. So I was cleaning up. Actually, my daughter came over to help me. Um, my office to try to organize some of my junk journal things. Y'all, because it has just been... It's a mess in here. I have so much stuff. Um, I'm okay that it has a red line going through it. It just looks like he's peeping over or something. We'll pretend. We'll pretend that's what it is. Anyway, and so I've noticed that there's some random feathers on my desk. <laughs> uh, yes. So... I love this washi tape and I want to use it so I'm going to I think because it's clear like how freaking cool is this and I'm just gonna put it right across the top like that um, I got this a while back like years ago at Joann's they had it on clearance and I bought a bunch of it. I've also given a bunch of it away, but I just think it's so pretty and so unique and it looks good like that. So we're going to put it across the top just to kind of give it a little something. And because I wanted to use it. And if it brings you joy, right? Okay. So I have that super cool. Maybe I should also... It would have been cool to put it on the bottom. See how I'm always decorating and undecorating? Because I put something down and then I do something different. And I'm like, oh, that would have looked... And I'm glad these come up pretty well off of that other paper. Now, finding the end is a challenge, but we did it. We did it. So, I'm just going to put this on the bottom of that right there, not the whole bottom. And then I can put this back down. Oh, yeah, I like that a lot. And let's go ahead and do some ladybugs on there so I can be happy with that. I like these. Okay, see, they're just random feather pieces. <laughs> it's getting on my nerves. Oh, goodness. I'm really happy with this lineup. So, with this, um, using it this way, 
I tried using the actual faith planner. The, the setup, it just doesn't work for me. Um, and the way that I use, even for Bible study, it's, it doesn't really, doesn't really work that well. So, um, I just have to find other planners that I can use that make it work the way I want it to. And that's the thing. Grab a planner and make it work the way you need it to work. All right, I'm going to put this down here. Please tell me I have white out. I don't, but I do have my white out pen, so I'll just use this over the notes. And I have been wanting to kind of change up the wellness, um, the physical wellness part of my planner. And so I have, and you'll get to see that later on this week on how I did that. And I think I'm going to be happier with it because I need to start, first of all, this is the month that I'm really hunkering down on my physical wellness, but I'm not going to get into that a whole lot right now because we're working on my spiritual wellness and I'm hunkering down on that. So we went to church this last Sunday for the first time since mom passed away. I don't know. And I've talked to several people who've lost parents, grandparents, you know, what have you. And it's also was hard for them to go back into church because memories and I don't know all the things, right? Um, but my son, our son, act like I was the only person parenting our son and daughter in love, his wife, um, got baptized on Sunday, which is super exciting. And, um, so we went obviously to support them and, uh, y'all, I just forgot how much I missed going to church um so we will we will continue on our on our journey um going to church the praise and worship was so good and all the things um so i'm very very glad that we went back and it was really nice Okay, I have one more gnome. Where am I gonna put this sweet little girl? Maybe we'll just put her right here and then all the ladybugs. Uh, there we go. And now we have all the ladybugs. I'm going to see if this works like it does on the Happy Planner. Because sometimes when I have just the little ones left, I do it like this. And that way I don't have, it's, for some reason, it becomes easier to pull them off. Okay, maybe not. Maybe my sticker paper's different. Anyway, it's not a big deal. Okay, Ladybug. I'm gonna do this. I don't know why I always feel like this is faster when I just peel multiple off. I know I've had this conversation before. Oh. It's bright and sunny, but still kind of overcast. So I'm, I'm not sure what the weather's gonna do today. I am not sure at all. Come on, ladybug. All right, now that I have choo, choo, choo. All right. Pardon me while I just scratch my arm in the middle of a video. What the heck is wrong with me? that to fall on the floor 
it's a lot of effort for me to uh, <laughs> pick stuff up off the floor. So I, I try to avoid that at all cost. All right, these are the last of the ladybugs. And the sheet is done. I like that for the most part. Um, my sheets can do an entire spread and then you don't have like little remnants left over. Not that that's a bad thing, but sometimes it's just hard, right? To figure out like what to do with just a few stickers. So I, I try to make it to where I can definitely use all the stickers that are on my sheet. So that is so cute. So stinking cute. I do love, love, love this. Um, and so this is it y'all. This is my spread for my faith planner. Um, again, if you have not, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell so you don't miss anything. And until next time, y'all have a blessed day. Bye!